do you teach private tennis lessons? What are you, what are you doing? Shut up, Andy. Welcome to CHW Studios, and today we are going to be recapping the movie Good Kids. The movie commences on a significant day in the lives of a group of youths as they navigate the daunting process of completing their college applications. However, their plans take an unexpected turn when they're tempted by some peers to explore a warehouse rumored to house disturbing remains. Sensing the seriousness of the situation and the lack of a coherent plan from their peers, they wisely decline the invitation, fearing the potential danger ahead. Fast forward eight years, and the once naive youths have evolved into high school graduates with promising futures. Yet, despite their academic accomplishments, they find themselves on the fringes of their peer celebrations, having been excluded from the graduation party circuit. This exclusion prompts a moment of reflection, as they realize that their decision to avoid the warehouse outing may have inadvertently isolated them from the social fabric of their community. Amidst the uncertainty and disappointment, Andy grapples with mixed emotions, acknowledging the absence of viable alternatives. However, their perseverance pays off as they eventually receive admission offers and scholarships to their desired colleges, signaling a new chapter filled with promise and opportunity. The scene is set for a transformative summer. Determined to make the most of their break, they dive into part-time work to fund their adventures. Andy takes on the role of a tennis instructor, while Nora delves into the world of science in a laboratory story, nursing a secret infatuation for her colleague, Erland. And the lion channels his strength into teaching MMA to kids. Amidst their bustling schedules, the lion encounters a new opportunity when one of his young students, Ant, extends an invitation to her party. Thrilled by the prospect of his first social event, he shares the news with Andy and Nora. Their conversation drifts to Andy's online crush, the enigmatic De from India, sparking playful banter and doubts about the authenticity of his connection. As they convene in Spice's kitchen, the lion's excitement for the party is met with reluctance from Nora and Spice. However, Andy challenges them to stay. Reminding them of the approaching summer and the need to embrace new experiences before college. Encouraging a summer of saying yes to life's opportunities, Andy implores his friends not to miss out on the chance to create lasting memories together. With their aspirations propelling them forward, each member of the group sets out to fulfill their desires. The lion seeks to broaden his experiences with substances, while Nora longs for a romantic connection, and Spice yearns to unleash his inhibitions. Following a successful training session with a group of women, Andy is approached by Gabby, who expresses interest in private instruction. Excited by the opportunity, Andy agrees to provide additional training at his home. However, his focus is momentarily diverted when he receives an arousing message from De about her new attire, prompting him to indulge in self-gratification. As they arrive at the gathering, a sense of unease lingers in the atmosphere. Seeking solace in beverages, they concoct their drinks, leading to an improvement in mood. However, the atmosphere takes a darker turn as they succumb to the allure of smoking. Amidst the haze, Nora spots Aaron and accepts his invitation to join him, while Andy captivates a group of individuals with his unique talent for catching objects in his mouth. Meanwhile, Spice finds himself in a compromising situation when a person invites him to their room. Struggling with his lack of experience, Andy confides in his companion, expressing his determination to embrace every opportunity before summer's end. In a parallel scenario, Spice's evening takes an unexpected turn when his encounter doesn't go as planned, leaving him feeling frustrated. Despite the ups and downs of the night, they reconvene the next day to reflect on their adventures. Spice shares news of another invitation to a gathering. Igniting excitement among the group. As Andy embarks on a private lesson with Gabby, he finds himself in an unexpected situation as she initiates a seductive encounter, setting the stage for further exploration and discovery. In a pivotal turn of events, Andy experiences his first sexual encounter, marking a significant milestone in his journey. Compensated for services, he later meets with his friends, only to witness Nora in a compromising situation with Erland, stirring discomfort within him. 
Before addressing the topic, he confides in Spice about his newfound business venture, which involves providing intimate services to married individuals to finance Da's prospective visit. Returning to his job, Andy continues to attract clientele for private sessions, accumulating a substantial sum. Meanwhile, tensions simmer as Andy confronts Nora about her involvement with Erland, leading to a tense exchange. Spice, in turn, questions Andy's moral stance, highlighting the paradox of his actions and casting a shadow over their camaraderie. As the night unfolds, Nora seeks comfort in Aaron's embrace, solidifying their bond with declarations of affection and physical intimacy. Meanwhile, Andy anxiously sends money to De, yearning for confirmation of her authenticity. The following day, Andy confides in Gabby about his inner turmoil, only to find himself in a predicament when her spouse unexpectedly returns home. Forced to flee without clothing, Andy's evening takes a dramatic turn as he is apprehended by the authorities. At the police station, Andy's exceptional mathematical skills catch the attention of an officer who enlists his help in completing paperwork for another detainee's mortgage. Eager to assist, Andy seizes the opportunity to contribute positively amidst the tumult of his personal affairs. S. Realization of Andy's feelings for Nora drives a wedge between them, complicating their already strained dynamic. Meanwhile, the lion seeks solace with the while Spice pursues a physical connection elsewhere. The climax unfolds at the party when the spouses of Andy's former clients confront him, leading to a violent altercation. In a surprising twist, the police officer who intervenes turns out to be the same individual Andy had previously assisted, resulting in their unexpected release and a ride home. As summer draws to a close, Andy and Nora finally confront their feelings, sharing a passionate moment. Andy's journey comes full circle as he returns to school, greeted with a playful gesture from his peers, signaling newfound acceptance and closure. I thought I was doing okay got hurt till the end of this way.